Hello, I'm Cameron Smith with Comcast CN100, and we're at the Sears Center in Hoffman Estates, Illinois. The modern-day gladiators are getting ready to do bout. Henderson versus Fedor, the Strike Force event of the year. Buckle up those seatbelts. It's going to be a bumpy ride. Who are you looking to see in the fight? I'm looking to see Fedor. I want him to win. His last fight was, I didn't like it too much, so I want to see him beat Hendo. I don't like Hendo. Henderson's my favorite fighter. I drove six hours back in March to go see him fight, so this is a lot closer, so I had to come see it. What brings you here for today's events? Why are you here? Oh, I am a huge MMA fan. I love Strike Force. I love the fights they've been putting together for the past couple of years. And tonight's fight between Fedor, Emelianenko, and Dan Henderson will prove to be nothing more than historic. What brings you here tonight? for this event. Uh, definitely the fights, uh, Fedor Hendo, a uh, big fight, you know, two legends of the sport. Fedor trying to jump on Henderson, quickly, left hook by Henderson. We want to get the female perspective. Who are you looking to see tonight? Um, well, I'm interested in seeing the female fighters. I've never actually seen them. I'm, I'm a big UFC fan and MMA. I've been a fan of it for a few years now. So I'm really interested to see the female fighters and see if they can duke it out. Jordan has never been submitted. All right, Mr. Lennon, just talk about the evolution of Strike Force and also MMA. Where do you see it going in the next five to ten years? It's been an exciting time at this point to see the sport of MMA growing and Strike Force the quality and the UFC being involved. You know, and from here on out, I see it continuing to grow. You know, we've got a young audience watching the sport. It's a great sport. One of the reasons I love the sport of mixed martial arts so much is the camaraderie, the sportsmanship, the mutual respect that most athletes have for each other. Now, do you see athletes and MMA fighters just getting stronger, quicker, faster as the years evolve? The sport's constantly evolving. That's the great thing. It's not something where it's static and, well, I'm going to learn this and everybody's going to do this. Everybody's constantly looking to grow in this sport. What a start to this fight! I'm here with a legend, referee Herb Dean. Herb, where do you see Strike Force going in the next five to ten years? Where do you see the evolution of the sport going? Uh, I mean, it's going to continue to do what it's doing. It's going to continue to grow. I think it's the best sport on earth, best fans, best athletes. Uh, you know, all sports are really a fight in some way or another. You're saying I can use my mind and body to beat you. Whatever we do so we don't hurt each other, it's still at the end of it, it's a fight. And so that's why people are drawn to this. Amelia Nanko rushing at Henderson, down! Fedor jumping on it! Beautiful escape by Hendo! Wow! Henderson scrambling! Whoa! Unbelievable! They stop it! They Whoa. stop it! Henderson! Fedor's stopping Fedor Amelia Nanko in the first round! What a fight! As you can see behind me, it's a wrap here at the Sears Center. Fans were treated to an electric battle of modern day gladiators. We saw a new champion being crowned in Misha Tate, and we also saw a living legend in Fedor falling to Dan Henderson. For Comcast CN100, I'm Cameron Smith. One shot.